Hi, thanks so much for tuning in to Woodstock Community Television. I'm Nikki McCallum. We are here on day three of the Vermont Film Festival. Today, I am joined by the one and only Brian Santiago, who is the writer, producer, and director of the short film Grafton. Brian, mm -hmm. thanks so much for joining us today. Yeah, thanks for having me. You're so welcome. Now, I have to say, I had the honor of seeing Grafton last night loved it. Thank you. It was a fan favorite. <laughs> Would love for you to share a little bit about the film. Well, the film is a psychological thriller in the vein of, let's say, an analog Black Mirror or an old Twilight Zone episode. And it's about a woman who gets lost on the interstate and she um, stumbles upon a small town where she reluctantly assumes the identity of someone else. Wild. <laughs> Wild. That part definitely tripped me up a little bit. I was just on the edge of my seat. So how did you come up with the idea for this film? What was the inspiration? It was a few things. It was a little bit of a darker time for me and also um, learning about the Bennington Triangle in Vermont and how people I, have gone missing. I I've actually heard named, about this. I named the lead character after one of the women who went missing because I'm obsessed with missing people for whatever macabre reason. <laughs> and um, I just came up with this story and it just... I just moved to Vermont. I didn't understand how everyone was so nice. I was from New York City and I was a little suspicious of it. <laughs> but I fell in love with it and I've been here ever since. So awesome. And this whole film was shot in Vermont. It was. It was shot and graft in the exteriors and then the interiors were at Catherine Partington's house in Guilford, Vermont, and then mm -hmm. partly on my property in Newfane, Vermont. So great. And how did you go about, I mean, you, you moved from New York to Vermont. How did you go about assembling your team? Are they mostly Vermonters, New York? How, who, no, who it, was, it was great. Um, it was people from all over, all my relationships that I've built from doing all of my stage productions and um, videos. And um, I had people from L.A., I had people from New York City, and I had people from Vermont. And that includes cast members. Um, I had Mike Williams, uh, Mike C. Williams from the original Blair Rich Project. So cool. um, him and I went to college together and we've been trying to create something for a while now. And then um, some of the actors were local in Brattleboro and my cinematographer was from LA and some of the crew was from Burlington and some of the crew was from New York. And I, I had the, like an all female camera crew, which is kind of unheard of and kind of badass. That's so cool. That's super awesome. Yeah. Super awesome. Let's take a look at the trailer. Okay, great. I just moved here a few months ago, and I'm just a little lost at the moment. I was wondering when you were going to come back. There are others like us. No, I don't believe you. There is no town of Glastonbury. But there is. That's where I live. No, no such town. See ya. Sorry. Don't be sorry. Be careful. Ah! You're home. Awesome. Super cool. Brian, what do you see as the future for this film? Do you have any plans or any other projects you're working on? Yeah, well, we just got distribution from the short. Um, thank you. And um, so we'll see where it lands. Um, Vermont Film Festival is our last festival, our last screening, which has been amazing. And um, so we're going to, we were going to pitch it as a series, but then there was this strike thing happened. Mm. <laughs> what strike? I, I know. Yeah. And things are still trying to piece themselves together, so we're focused on making it a feature first. That's so cool. Shot all in Vermont. I love that so much. And so, okay, so, so feature next and then potentially a series. Yes. Yeah. Total cliffhanger, so we're hoping we can create some demand, and yeah. That's so cool. And the feature, is it going to be the same characters? Is it going to be an extended version of the short, or same concept with different... same char Same characters, okay. um, same concept, but an expanded story. Because awesome. the story is a, itself is kind of a cliffhanger, so we're going to answer a lot of those questions and probably create a few new ones. Awesome, awesome. And you mentioned you got distribution. Yeah. Am I, am I allowed to ask where people will be able to see the film? We don't know yet. Okay, okay. But we're hoping some are good. Awesome. Yeah. Awesome. I hope so too. Well, Brian, thanks so much for joining us. So great having you. And I can't wait to see what happens with Grafton. Thank you so much, Nikki. You're welcome. Appreciate it.